So today was a fantastic, fantastic live stream and uh, I had a lot of fun over there. And these are the crates that I ended up gaining. Now, of course, as always, I do want to show some brief highlights of this said live stream because it was a little interesting and some some things definitely happened. So let's check it out. By the way, real quick, just wanted to mention one thing. Today is World Download Day, and that's right. If you're a Discord Premium member of any tier or a member on Twitch or a member on Patreon of any tier, you get access to the World Downloads all found on the Discord, and that is linked down in the description below. So be sure to check that out. And of course, guys, let's get on with today's video. Let's do this. Oh my gosh, fast and gilded. We have minus two minutes on the clock. These are the only ones that really hurt. I'll just pop this open. Wow, that was a waste. Oh, this is an Omega room, right? What do I need to do, guys, to this room? What do I do? Do I go down there? Wait, I press this? Okay, that's crazy. Oh, I missed these. I mean, that was uh, that was some epicness right there. So yeah, the backpacks do have auto pickup on on certain things. Paint buckets have loot as well. The paint buckets have loot. I. Uh, I'll go back and check. Like I really need ore. That's what I'm really after. <laughs> yeah, the paint buckets, they have ore, all right. They have loot, yeah, uh-huh. Nice, okay. That had an anvil in it. That's got some kind of black fluid. Okay, let's get out of here. Chosen arch level. Oh man. I think I got enough time to get through this. Come on. Yeah. All right. Let's go. That's a. That's a clock. Uh. What's that mean? The clock is a clue for a special vault on how to create it, what modifiers it means. There are three clues and they are only found in that Omega room smile. Three clues. So the clock is a clue. Upgrade the vein miner. You think I should? To do 16 blocks? Have you what thought are... about selecting the specialization shaman for your rampage skill? It works really well against bosses. D, it's up to you which specialization you like the sound of. The rampage one is worth it. Like I've, I have the rampage, um, but I was looking at the specializations. The only one that looked like it was even worth it was this one. The extended, extends the duration. Um, but it sacrifices some of the original damage boost, so you'd only get twenty percent, but you get twenty. Uh, shaman is the best. Wait, what? It deals damage over time. Shaman makes bosses a joke. Oh, I see that. I'll actually, I'll take it. I'll take Shaman. That's the only specialization I've I've chose. I know Dash can heal me, but the problem is, is I use my Dash for everything. 
These are nice, but I I I like the uh the cooldown. The immune is is nice though. All right, we let's do this. Go. That's that's pretty nice. That's kind of what I want. What was the modifiers again? Slowed healing. Oh, we get regeneration. The regeneration is going to be really nice for this room. Hey, Chosen, I just want to clear something up that you may not understand. When you upgrade a skill, you may be inclined to believe that it's additive when in fact it's not. The same goes for specializations. On level 1 Vein Miner, you get an extra level of fortune to a pickaxe, but when you upgrade Vein Miner, you don't get another extra level of fortune. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I, I think I... Oh, okay. So I understand what you're saying. So you're saying for this, I only get plus one. So I basically wasted my skill point. I only get plus one right here will give me plus two, which would give me five. Okay. So really I'm only getting fortune four. Okay. That is kind of confusing. Just a little tip. If you would like to play it safe, you can make a soul flame and apply it to a crystal. This will ensure if you die in the vault that all the things you went in with will be soul bound to you so you won't lose anything smile but do note that you won't have a chance to get an artifact if you kill the boss in the soul flame crystal show love 100. Huh. Paxels are pretty pog. Are they? Ever? I don't know. I've had it listed but I just... I didn't know if it was worth all this. I mean it is every... I guess it would be nice. Alright, Paxel... It's a pickaxe, axe, and shovel. And then we need to enchant this bad boy. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh, okay. Um, let's go. I am not even going to worry about what's going on there. Let's do it. Not even going to second guess. Oh man, speedy, resilient, and a scavenger vault. Man, and that, that is a lot to scavenge. Yeah, this scavenger hunt, oh man, it's not good. I don't know why this one's so stressful. I just wanted a boss, but I feel like these vaults are getting more and more stressful. I mean, I gotta kill him anyways, so might as well. So I got the two spider fangs, I have the A scroll. And I still haven't found a room. Oh, we did it. I need to put, uh... Hold on, I need... This in here. Oh, we did it, chat! Oh, I'm so stressed. I am beyond stressed right now. Oh, I am beyond. Oh man, if I had a heart rate monitor, you know what? My my chest would be just on fire. Do this. Let's go. Strong, crowded, unlucky. <laughs> This is awful. Yeah, this one's definitely for farming the shards. Um, okay. What? This could be a good place to fight a boss. Is this the same one? Oh, this is different. Oh my gosh, vault room. There it is. Okay. Pretty decent room. I don't see TNT. There's a hole. Give me a boogie. Oh. 
Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Did it go down downstairs? Dude, it revived itself. That was crazy. Crazy part, did I get my boss crate? Yes, I did. Whew. What a crazy fight, man. Whew. I'm shaking. <laughs> my hands are shaking. So let's check out the loot that we ended up getting from all that because we ended up completing a scavenger hunt during this whole thing, which is a really nice crate. And we also killed a boss, which was, let's just say, uh, slightly stressful, as you've probably seen. Um, so we have our boss crate here, and uh, there's a lot of stuff that I want to grab out of here and talk about. The one thing I wanted to go for when running these vaults was uh, ore, but I didn't really get a whole, whole lot of ore. Um, I did, however, manage to get several, several, um, vault diamonds, um, and we also got some raffle catalysts, which, uh, I'm kind of interested in, actually. We might actually run a raffle catalyst today. Kind of scary now that I think about it, because it locks the vault, but we'll, uh, we'll talk about that in a second. So, yeah, tons of ore. We'll go ahead and grab a few. Still missing certain ores. Um, I've not seen some ores that uh, we could potentially get, but I did end up running a few of these and and they had some really nice rooms. Even ended up finding a whole block of netherite. <laughs> I was so surprised by that. I was like, just a, a solid block of netherite. How oh, nice. Um, we also ended up rolling this. So this is a Pandora's box. I'm kind of scared to open this, but it could be anything. It just says right click to open. Oh, and we'll do it again. Okay, you know what? As much as I, I don't like or care about the coral, it's actually kind of useful. <laughs> oh, by the way, we uh, we do have a vault paxel now. I'll talk about that here in a little bit. But yeah, we can actually now bone mill those. <laughs> so it is kind of useful, I guess, right? Because we, we've just got to roll this stuff. Let's see, we also ended up getting some here. So this is really nice. Let's take this. Anything else? I think that's just about it for right now. Um, other than like the statues and stuff that we have, not a, not a huge deal. We're gonna get those every vault we run. But I did notice that I am getting this every time we kill a boss or complete an objective. So I'm gonna be trying my best to kill bosses or complete objectives from now on. Um, now, some stuff that I did do during the live stream that I wanna talk about. I did go ahead and take on a rampage specialization called Shaman. And uh, I did use this on the boss, and I noticed right off the bat, this is insane. So this is going to destroy the boss, or at least it did start to destroy the boss. It did so much damage over time. Like I just watched the health bar just drain after I used it. So definitely worth it. Let's go ahead and open this. Oh, it's a pickaxe head. This is a part of the miner set. And I think this goes with this. So here's the miner set. So now I have two of just about everything. <laughs> I should like put these sets together just to show you, like I have a set for just about everything. Like right here, these are all double sets and I'm just kind of waiting for everything else. <laughs> it's it's kind of nice though. Like eventually we'll have a full, full relic to put together. All right, let's roll this. I'm kind of excited for the weapon because this is uh, unidentified. It rolled scrappy. All of these are ro ro rolled, these rolled scrappy plus. Let's roll them. We're gonna hear a lot of horn sounds. And there we go. <laughs> so what did we get? Any good modifiers? Ooh, this is 4% knockback resistance. And this is a common. So this actually rolled a common. Only has one level though. Uh, just our plain idol. This is just a regular scrappy. This is kind of a blast sword. 
Armor toughness. Now, some of this stuff is going to be worth it because I don't think we have, like, on our leggings, we don't have anything rolled on our leggings. Um, and our helmet doesn't have anything. So this might be worth it. No, actually not. It's just a little less. It has a lot more, looks like, knockback resistance, but... I mean, it is kind of cool looking. <laughs> no, no, the vault leggings. Wait, these leggings are nice because... Yeah, these leggings are real nice because these have armor toughness modifier and we don't have that. I went ahead and cleared out all of those chests. Everything is nice and cleaned up, but I do have a few things that uh, I want to go ahead and take out of the mystery boxes. So let's throw all these. There's got to be some good stuff out of this. Wow. That's a lot of mystery boxes. All right, six more. And there's a lot of stuff in here. Um, lots of books, apparently. And that is just the beginning. Wow. Okay. Um, I did go ahead and add some more storage to the side because, man, we do not have nowhere near enough storage for a lot of this stuff. Look at that. Actually, I'll take that. Look at all that glass. So, yeah, this actually, uh, turned really kind of profitable. Like, I have some obsidian laying around. We have tons of wool. Um, and now I've got to see what these relic booster packs contain. Now, I know I didn't notice it right away in my inventory, but, uh, I did get a picker ring. Um, that's kind of awesome, actually. Uh, but I do have these that I want to sort of split up, uh, and open as well. The picker ring, we're going to enchant this bad boy, but, uh, yeah, that, that's going to really come in handy. But I've got to, uh, open all of these. There's the potential of something coming out of these. Eh, well, we got a mystery box. But I think we got one of the best things. We got a Pickering straight out of there. Now, normally a Pickering, uh, it is craftable normally, but, uh, yeah, this is, this is something, this is really nice. Like, oh yeah. Like that'll, it goes quite the distance, right? It doesn't do a whole lot of damage, but it goes quite the distance and will break the block that it hits and then come back to you. Really, really useful tool. And this, we can put mending efficiency on, uh, on breaking and all that stuff, just like a normal pickaxe. This is, this is really cool. So now that I have myself a crystal, what exactly am I going to do with this? This is a normal, I think I want to spend it using the seal of the challenger raffle on the Skalda. I believe. And so to do this, I do this. And it's going to be a kill the boss objective, a raffle, which means the vault is locked. The like it's locked. Like either we kill the boss or we die to the timer. I'm stressed. I'm already stressed. Um <laughs> uh this is this is actually kind of terrifying. Um now I don't think I can add a soul flame to it. Like, that's something that you could also do. Apparently, we could add Soul Flame to this. Um, I, I'm going to risk it. I'm going to risk it. We do have Vault Gear, so I'm not super worried. I do have the ability to, to go in with some decent gear if I do die and lose all my stuff. That would really... That would be pretty awful. We lose all of our bags. I mean, that would be... That would be a nightmare. Um, but I think it's doable. Uh, so... We should be fine. Like, we should we should be okay. I do have my power bar. I have all my upgrades. I have totems of undying, so I should I should be prevented from uh, from dying to the boss, hopefully. <laughs> um, I have my bars. We have our new ring. I think we're good. Now, I don't know what other modifiers could possibly be on this. I don't know if it just randomly generates stuff but this boss could be more difficult oh now i'm worried all right the more i think about it the more i don't want to do it let's just do it let's go i think we're good difficult kill oh my gosh difficult gilded lucky and a raffle vault oh boy i literally have three to find that's it three to find and then we should be good. The difficult? I don't know how bad this is going to be, but it does put the boss at an advantage. A pretty high advantage. 
Oh, and I am... I'm just going for it. Our first, ob first obelisk. This is not the ideal situation. Not at all. Oh, goodness. So I found another obelisk. I'm going to go ahead and mark this one because this actually is a pretty decent place to find it. See if we can't find the other one. So here we go. There's this one. And uh, now I just have 15 minutes or so to get to the boss. Oh boy, I am, I'm kind of stressed actually because this boss could, could kill me. So on my way back, I actually ended up finding a better one. This is a, this is a much better place, I think, to fight this boss. Just need to make sure everything's nice and clear. So when we do fight it, things will be a little easier. But man, that difficulty is going to be rough. Oh man, why couldn't I got like stronger or something? Ooh, this is going to be difficult. Okay. Um, I need to just store everything in my bag. Oh, come on. Everything's after me now all at once. My, where did my rain go? Oh, no. My rain's gone. What? Where? What? So, yeah, I, uh, I forgot to hit the record button. Uh, good news, though, uh, it was just like a ghost item. My, my boomerang is back. I, but I, I, I didn't record the boss. Darn. I didn't record this whole section after fighting this thing. No! Can I rewind? I can't. I just, I just, I just lost that foot. It was so stressful. And it was, no, I killed it. I killed the boss. Oh, that's not okay. This is the boss credit drop. What? And I didn't record the footage. I'm so mad at myself. Generates a random resource until it dies. What is this? This is the boss that I killed. I, I did. I did all of that and I forgot to hit the record button. I'm so mad at myself. Well, you know what that means? <laughs> Well, I've got to do the other one, of course. Of course I do. Man, oh man, may the vault gods be with me on this one. Oh, I, I hope so. I really hope so. Let's do this. Raffle and crowded. Oh, it's like literally the worst. And we have four to find. Crowded is going to make that boss not so fun. First obelisk. Let's hope we find more quickly. Another one. Two more to go. I'm going to mark this one. This might actually be a good one to come back to. Ooh. Yes. Let's take this one and then head back. And I got to prepare. I will guess I'll prepare as I go. So here we go. I am preparing. I'm eating all the stuffs. This is really worth it. I think the last thing I have to do is eat the power bar. And we are good. Power bar. Activate. And then just go at it. Come on. Man. Come on. The damage over time is really nice. So much health. And I got it this time. Oh man, that was good. That was good. Make sure we we boss it up. Make sure we get our boss crate. <sighs> I feel good about that. I do. I feel good about that. Oh boy. This time I actually captured it on on good old film. And now we can place it down. Is this one better? Wow, okay, so we rolled some good stuff here too. Oh man, why is that gotta be so stressful? Oh, we got our first artifact! Yes! Artifact for the win! Oh, what is it? Let's roll it. Our first artifact. Oh man. 
Oh man. <laughs> oh, is that a is that a captain? Is that, that's a captain sparkles right there. Right there. Where do we where are we gonna put this? I mean, we've got to, of course hang it on the wall right here. That's our first artifact. <sighs> Man, do I feel good about that. Let's open these, because we did get a couple of them and we might be able to complete our first set. Oh, we're so close. We ended up getting doubles. So we do have doubles of that, doubles of that. A pickaxe handle for the miner set. So we actually have one more piece for the miner set and then there's another cupcake. Oh man, my nerves are shot for today. I think I've, I've done so much. There's a vault axe. Let's roll this and see what we get. That would be really cool to get something nice. And plus five attack. That's actually not super bad. That's better than what we have, but our sword is still way, way better. Still way better. Also, what do we unlock on our pants? So we got plus one armor and plus one armor toughness on our pants. So we're even we're even more of a boss now. Oh, that's so nice. What else? So we have all of this armor to, to roll. Let's do this. I am I am stoked. This is where the fun happens. There's another vault axe. So these are all chess pieces. I don't think, yeah, our chess piece is actually pretty decent. So this one already has thorns plus durability, and this one has two repairs. This one's junk. Uh, junk. I think compared to what we already have, not worth it. And then as far as vault axe, this one's better, even though that's all it does is that plus five damage. Really, I'm not going to be able to use any of those compared to what I currently have. Let's see what these look like when they're on a chest, because as of right now, neither one of these is on a chest. So what do these look like? Oh, they can't be placed down. Oh, so, so they're placed like this. Okay. Oh, they're like vault bosses. That is, that is cool looking. I'm like literally trying to figure out where to place chests because we have so much, so much stuff. I guess right here and right here to show off that we did this. And these are the two bosses that we fought. Oh man, so cool. I'm loving this pack so far. Like there's so much stuff that goes on that you guys don't even realize the amount of stress uh, and excitement I get every time I run one of these is insane. And I think by the way, after doing those, I think, let's see, what's this roll? That's gravel. I think we might be able to make another knowledge shard, but I'm not sure. And, and even if we did, uh, the knowledge that we, the things that we can unlock are very limited. Um, so I think that we would probably be going for another, uh, decoration mod, like a couple more decoration mods, because right now everything's back up to its full price. Unless I go for waystones. I don't know. Waystones, ah, man, that's one point. That is, sounds really good. That's going to bring everything else up by one. Well, guys, today has been, uh, been quite the day, quite the day. I think I, I've gotten quite a bit done. I am super excited about the adventures to come and uh, definitely when I get back, I should have uh, a new uh, a new thing. So uh, hopefully on Monday, which uh, the video next video will be out on Monday. Um, we'll have to wait till Tuesday. I'm kind of excited to see what uh, what's to come. We've got a lot of stuff, a lot more vaults to run, a lot more cool things to potentially unlock and not to mention I've got a lot of burgers. Like, I'm not joking. Like, we have so many burgers that we can craft. Might as well put some of these to use. Like, I mean, we have over a stack and a half. Like, come on, at least we can get to 32 and maybe unlock a couple more mods. That would be kind of nice. I think that's all gonna have to happen next episode because today, well, I wanna thank the sponsor of today's video. And that huge thanks well, it's going to go to Crash. Thank you so much for your amazing support over on the Discord, becoming a Discord premium member. And of course, guys, I would love for you to join the Discord, join this community, follow me over on Twitch, do do all those things. I, do, I even have a Twitter if you, if you want to follow me there. Uh, I even have an Instagram, all those fun places. Of course, guys, be sure to check those out. All of those linked down in the description below. I absolutely love your face. Be sure to click that subscribe and I'll see you in the next episode. And as always, Thanks for watching.